Okay, everybody. Uh, this is Bart again. I wanted to come uh, bring y'all a quick little uh, video to y'all and um, demonstrate something that I want to talk about. And uh, I hope y'all kind of like it. So uh, it's gonna be another new video for y'all. Um, it's gonna be some um, about battery saving tips and techniques that I use to help save battery. Because in uh, OS. 10.3.2 and 10.1 I mean um, 10.3.1 OS has this feature in it and it really hasn't really changed much from 3.1 to 3.2 and some a lot of people don't know this uh, feature and they don't some people don't realize that it's there so uh, I'll show you a few trick few tricks and tips that will help save on battery life that you can squeeze a couple of more hours out of your battery we all know the passport has great battery life and the z10 is not so good but either way whether you got a passport a z10 or a or a blackberry leap it all works the same and the tips is uh used across the board with all the phones so um definitely will help you to squeeze extra battery out of your um, out of your BlackBerry 10 device. So um, I'll be back in a second. Okay, everybody, this is Bart again. I'm here with the third, the second video. Um, I said I was come back with the second part, so here we are. And uh, basically, your phone, the when you have different apps and things like that, you install apps. I have quite a few apps as you can tell so sometimes these programs some and 10.3.1 and 10.3.2 are headless and two point and uh, OS 10.2.1 the they allowed the apps to be installed headless where they actually run in the background and what happens is these apps use battery and so forth and 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 three dot one they actually the Android apps is runs headless because they actually allow it, the Android apps to run in the background while the apps is closed and you could listen to music while the apps is closed and so forth so a lot of these things takes up battery it uses battery it uses memory and it, it uh, slows down your phone a little bit and uh, not too much if you have a passport, but it does affect your uh, your battery life. So basically, I have an app that I use to this lets me know what apps is running in the background. I go to my utility folder and I click Task Manager. This app here shows me everything Android apps is running. As you can see, I got Chrome, I got Google Maps my Google Play services and my antivirus now my antivirus I really particularly don't have to have it okay but I just have it just mainly for if I install antivirus you know Android apps that you not sure of that's from a particular unknown source and stuff so it's just for extra protection I've never caught anything with the actual app so uh, I'm not sure why I have it on here it's just, I guess, an extra layer of protection. When I know the, the BlackBerry OS is, is protecting me anyway. So, but this these particular apps is running in the background. So, there's two ways you can kill it. One, you click it and it'll be killed. But I don't want to kill it. There's another tip that I want to do that I'm going to show y'all how to turn these apps off if you don't have this particular program and if this works with um, Blackberry 10 uh, apps as well so what we do here first tip you can do is you turn you could turn battery save mode on which it it slows down your screen and uh, cycles down your CPU performance and this is on 10th and 3.1 this feature was added so it actually allows you to squeeze a little bit extra battery life 
with the operating system with some um, fine-tuned presets settings that's already set so uh, but I'm not gonna have it on I want to leave the screen bright for y'all to see but basically we do we go into settings and uh, app management and device monitor okay and the first thing it goes into is battery save right here you see all the different apps that is in the corner guard it's in the correct order as to what apps uses the most battery on your phone as you can see right off the top the display uses 19 percent of battery uh system twitter is actually using the most battery out of all the apps that i have at a whopping 2.5 percent facebook 0.6 percent and as you go on it gets lesser and less so basically what i want to show you is uh, let's click on the memory tab right here and this shows your memory usage and this actually tells you which apps is running in the background okay remember we seen Chrome in the task manager a while ago okay well it's actually running in the background it's it's using battery so we click Chrome to get into the features this particular tip I want to show you is that right underneath you got the the clear application data and stuff to help improve battery performance you can turn off the run when minimize permissions for this app and you click change app permission and as you see right here it says run when minimize allows this app to perform task when minimized apps that run when minimized consume battery power turn this off option off to improve battery life so this is what we want to do turn it off and this prevents the app from running in the background when you restart your phone uh, when you restart your phone all these apps start up when you compute when your phone starts and they consume battery so that's change and right here at the bottom they got close and delete right now the app is actually running because you have the option is blue for you to close you can see Chrome doesn't use very much battery power not a lot but the, 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 but the thing is is that it's still using power so and if you have person that needs every drop of battery life that you can squeeze out of your battery this app is not helping you so you, you could turn off that feature I mentioned before the run when minimize and click close Clo uh, Chrome will be closed and all programs associated with it will be stopped so we we'll hit OK now the close button is grayed out is grayed out and we come into my task manager you see we closed it it's now closed so we go back back into my settings for my uh, phone and we click back and when you do the same exact thing see I got pirate right here uh, pirate is a voice recording app and it's the same thing you can see how the little close button is not grayed out so this app is actually running in the background sucking a little bit of juice out of my battery so we're gonna close this close the pirate app and this particular app don't have the settings for you to turn it off in the background um, to where it stops running in the background so every time you um, restart your phone just kind of have to keep in mind to come in here and certain particular apps that you don't use like me I don't I have the pirate app but I very seldom use it so 
being that I do a fresh restart on my phone, it don't pay for me to have this running in the background. So I just come in here <clears throat> under memory usage and I look through all the ones that I have. As you can see, Blackberry ID, that's running. I use that. That's for my Google uh, Play services and um, the YouTube app that I use to log on so I could upload the videos with. Uh, WhatsApp, same thing. You have you can change the background app permissions right here. But I use this app, so I'm actually going to leave it running. But you have the option to close it if you're not using it and so forth. And you can see it uses 0.8% of battery. So basically, you go through each app you have on the memory usage. Uh, Pocket Safe I use. But this particular app don't have it, but you have the option to close it if you need be. So every app that's running in memory is what's being used. So like BBM meetings. I actually can close it because I'm not actually using the uh, using it right now so we're gonna go ahead and close it from running in the background to help improve battery life um, so let's go back to the battery see and um, the actual reason why it's green this battery chart is because when it's green right here, it's, it, it signifies that it's in battery save mode. So it'll help to save, that's when battery save mode's on. When it's white, as you see on the right side, it's out of battery saving mode. So currently, currently power saving mode is on. So let me go ahead, oh, battery saving mode is off. So, but, <clears throat> Go back into your battery usage, and you could actually can fine tune the uh, different apps, like the Amazon App Store. The same thing. If it's running in the background, you can close it. And if it has the option to turn it off, now I, I want to um, mention something as I go through the phone. They have different types, different apps through all through the whole thing through the whole phone see your youtube app that i have the same thing run when minimize so i keep that on because i do use it certain apps you actually cannot that feature i just showed here change uh, change app settings some apps this turns off and it does a pretty good job. Sometimes there are some apps that are stubborn. And you actually have to go into the app and change the settings. Change your um, settings for notifications. Change the settings so that uh, if, if that particular app don't want to seem to close. Well, there's something on in the app that's making it come on. So you have to go in your app. Change your settings, change your notifications, change um, background app refresh, and different things that could be causing the app to actually stay running in background. Because uh, sometimes this particular tip closes the app, and sometimes it don't. So, but um, getting back to all everything. So we got pirate right here, the, the least battery usage, it's closed. So basically, you know, that them tips that I just gave y'all is one of the best things that I use to help save battery. And also some other things that I do to help save battery is keep, keep my phone in battery save mode. Keep my phone in battery save mode. And another tip I'm going to share with you. Turn location services off. 
If location services is on, every time you use an app, every time you go somewhere, every time you do something, the app actually, the location services constantly checks for your location. And when it does, it uses battery and it's not a lot, but it still sucks a little bit of battery out of your phone. So keep that off and keep battery save mode on and use those tips that I did with the actual apps that you can go in there and close the apps. You can close the actual apps out. Let me close these out so that you can help save on the battery. So uh, I'll be back shortly with a with the next part with the closing part of the video so um, I hope this quick tip actually allowed y'all to save a little bit of battery on your phone or maybe a lot of battery but some apps have more use more battery than others so you will see a difference as you close certain apps and how your phone responds so I'll be back in a second all right everybody i came back with the third part like i said so uh basically i hope that the tips i gave you will help you you know um these are these are tricks that i use that helps me out with the battery and that's how i can i manage to squeeze sometimes two days out of my battery out of my passport because um I tweak my phone with my apps and stuff to see what's running and what's not running and, and allows me to get every bit of battery usage I can out of my phone. So um, I definitely hope that y'all enjoyed this video and um, if I think of any other battery saving tips I will definitely will make a, another video. If you have any questions leave a comment in the comment section and I'll leave a link in the descriptions. And uh, please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And also, I have a new Twitter account. It's um, twitter.com slash uh, at littlebyte76. I'll put a link in the, in the descriptions for y'all because uh, I, I just opened it up. And so, please leave me a comment. Uh, leave me a comment if you like my video. And please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And um, take care.